No matter what happens, this and this was not a mistake. Nothing's gonna happen. And just like that, things got a whole lot more complicated for Carrie and Aiden. It's interesting because the past is not exactly smooth. So, you know, how does the past affect the present? Yeah. And is there a future? Leading up to the season two finale of Max's Sex in the City revival series, and just like that, John Corbett's Aiden had to rush home to Virginia after his 14-year-old son Wyatt mixed drugs and alcohol and crashed his truck. Why was he going to the farm? <laughs> he said, I want to sleep at my dad's house. <laughs> I should have been there, Carrie. One doesn't plan, you can't control how the other person will behave. And when Aiden returned, he finally stepped into Carrie's old apartment, despite saying he never would because of all their painful memories there, and explained why he needed to go back to Norfolk for good. You're not going to be coming back up here every other week like we've been doing? I am. So not even when he's at Kathy's? This happened while he was at Kathy's. He hitched back to the farm because he wanted to be back home. I'm home. The show's writer, director, and executive producer, Michael Patrick King, gave fans a little more insight into that scene on the Writer's Room podcast. We're bringing Aiden back. She's not going to hurt him because she knows she can't, and we also don't want the fans to think we did that again. <laughs> so he's going to hurt her. And the only way we knew that he would ever pull away from her is if the bigger love, and every parent would assume that this is a bigger love, is the responsibility and your love for your children. God, I can't believe we're back here again. Hey, no, no, no. We're not back. Hey, we're not back here again. Gary, listen, listen, look at me, look. The only thing, the only thing that I love more than I love you is my boys. And that's when Aiden hits Carrie with a big request. Just give me some time. How much time? <sighs> Till Wyatt's out of his teens. That's six years. It's five, his birthday's next week. Five years will go by like. It's a rich relationship. The two share a kiss, spend the night together, and in the morning, Aiden gets on his flight for the last time. John made his debut on the revival series earlier this season, bringing his beloved character back to our screens nearly 20 years after the original series went off the air. She's dated a lot of guys throughout the show, but for whatever reason, they liked our chemistry together and it just worked out for me. And back in June, Sarah Jessica told E.T. why they brought him back. It's undeniably um, exciting as an actor and certainly for writers to explore who are they now? Are they yeah. good for each other? Are they, um, you know, apologetic? Are they tr trying to uh, course correct in some ways? Are they better for each other? Are they worse for one another? Um, and it's just a hugely joyful thing to explore. Max announced that the show has been renewed for season three, so we'll just have to wait and see how Carrie and Aiden's love story unfolds.